What's up everyone, Dabblade here with a very quick information video regarding the day 7 limited bounties for the Spring Blossom Festival in Monster Hunter World. This is for both PC and console versions of the game and they still currently have exactly the same limited bounties going on. And remember, depending on where you live in the world, the reset times for limited bounties can differ. So what are the limited bounties we have today? Well, we have four of them. First is a field research event limited bounty to complete just one event quest. And it can be at high or low rank. And for doing so, you get research points, an atmosphere, a spring blossom ticket, and blossom fireworks. Next is an ecology survey to hunt Puke Puke. We have to hunt one of these bird wyverns, and again, it can be at high or low rank. And for doing so, you get research points, an atmosphere plus, a spring blossom ticket, and blossom fireworks. Next is a field research challenge event quest to complete one high ranking challenge quest. Challenge quests are found up in the Gathering Hub by talking to the Arena Lass. And for taking one on, you'll get research points, a hard atmosphere, a spring blossom ticket and blossom fireworks. And then finally is the general limited bounty to complete all of today's other limited bounties. And for doing so, you get research points, a heavy atmosphere, a spring blossom ticket and blossom fireworks. So those are the limited bounties we have today. In all honesty, not too hard at all. The Field Research Challenge Limited Bounties used to be difficult until the introduction of Vespoid Infestation and the Gajalaka Outbreak, but now the challenge quests aren't so much of an issue. So first go up to the Gavron Hub and as I mentioned take on the challenge quest Gajalaka Outbreak. This is by far the easiest high ranking challenge quest available in Monster Hunter World. Challenge quests can be tricky because they force you to use preset loadouts, but I found just using the Lance or the Heavy Bowgun made this one a pushover. Afterwards, it's a case of taking on a Puke Puke of your choice via an event quest. So take on either Where Sun Meets Moon or Greeting the Gluttons, whatever takes your fancy. And that should get all of today's limited bounties done in just two quests. But anyway, that's about it for Day 7. Don't forget to check back tomorrow for Day 8. And until next time, I've been Dabley, bringing you a quick information video regarding the Day 7 limited bounties for the Spring Blossom Festival in Monster Hunter World. Hope you enjoyed the little video. Thanks for watching, subscribe and like for more.